why own shares? Owning a share in a company means you own part of a company. It may be a tiny portion. For example, owning one share in Apple means you own around six billionths of a percent of that company, but it's still ownership. And that means you have a stake in how the company operates and how it performs. There's probably three main reasons you might hold shares in a company. First, shareholders get a say in how the company is run. You're eligible to attend company AGMs and, depending on the type of share, can vote on major business decisions. Your voting capability depends on how much of the company you own, so decisions do tend to be made based on the wishes of the largest shareholders. But, like any sort of election, every shareholder gets their say. The second is capital gains. This is simply the profit you make on your shares if the share price goes up. This is why many people actively invest, even in companies that are not making profits. The third reason is about dividends. Well, dividends are a regular payment to shareholders based on the earnings the company has made in the most recent period and is a major reason why many people who do not actively trade hold shares. You can buy shares in a company and without selling them receive a regular stream of income from dividends. Of course, in general, companies only pay out dividends if they've made a profit. And in many industries, it can be many years before a company starts to even make any sort of profit. But in general, large stable companies will tend to pay regular dividends to its shareholders. As an example, over the last four quarters, Apple paid out quarterly dividends of 22 cents per share. So if you bought one Apple share at $129 just before the first of those dividend payments, you'd have received 88 cents over the past year. Now, that might not sound like much, but it's a rate of 0.68%, which is higher than many savings rates. And remember, this is just one company. Dividends can be paid in cash, as that Apple example showed, or in stock, where the company effectively gives shareholders free additional shares based on how many shares they already owned.